Online and mobile sports betting can have various adverse consequences consequences, including anxiety and depression, reduced work productivity, financial difficulties, and strained relationships. According to the Washington Post, in the United States, one to two six percent one to two six percent of adults have a gambling disorder, according to most studies. Popular forms of gambling include horse racing, football, baseball, basketball games, fantasy sports, hockey matches, and many others. Good afternoon, my name is Charlie Palumbo, and my topic of research is on sports gambling. My research question I developed shows the extent sports gambling has on individuals' mental health in the United States. Based on my research question, I believe sports gambling will negatively affect adults financially, often causing their work productivity to suffer. Sports gambling also can create distance in personal relationships and will lead to depression and or anxiety. My first claim is financial issues. Sports betting in the U.S. generated record venue of $1.5 billion in 2020, up 69% from last year, according to the gambling, American Gambling Association. In the first quarter of this year, Sports betting venues increased 270% from last year, another record. A 29-year-old man from Rhode Island had hit rock bottom due to sports gambling. He had been throwing away money on sports betting for years, but the COVID-19 pandemic brought it to a new level. Trapped in his house, staring at his computer screen all day, the man experienced a depression that drove him to gamble more and more and more. He once said, I started to bleed money, chasing his losses he took out for high interest loans. Then he emptied his 401k account. Even after finally coming clean to his wife and promising to quit, he still continued to bet, increasing his losses to about 200000 My second claim is anxiety and depression. Beyond the initial feelings of sadness from losing, when someone has a gambling problem, they may feel depressed, as well as perhaps experiencing feelings of shame, guilt, shame and guilt. Increased moodiness and frustration loss and frustration, loss of interest in activities, and friends feeling tired and worthless struggling to sleep or finding it difficult to get out of bed loss of appetite, negative or hopeless thoughts. My third claim is on strained relationships. The effects of pathological gambling on families, dynamics and functioning can be devastating. Pathological gamblers have higher rates of divorce, 53.5%, as compared to non-pathological gamblers, 18.2%, and of the deception, financial depth, and emotional absence. Pathological gambling is a disorder that can have many diverse and unintended consequences. From a medical perspective, pathological gamblers are at increased risk to develop stress-related conditions such as hypertension, sleep disorders, cardiovascular disease, and peptic Euler disease. Possible solutions to help prevent sports gambling are seeking gambling addiction help, talking about gambling with someone you trust. It can reduce the stress that can cause you to continue to gamble. Finding an alternative to gambling. Instead of gambling, you can fill that gap that you used to use with gambling as other activities you may use to enjoy instead of that and joining a support group. Joining a support group, there are many groups you can join and they are all free and confidential and help support you in your addiction. However, with these so solutions, there are limitations. With these solutions, most individuals are too shy to reach out for help. To reach, to rep, yeah. They may not feel uncomfortable talking about their addiction to sports gambling. Finding an alternative activity is not always the best choice and joining a support group doesn't work most of the time. 
It is my work side of page. Thank you. Any questions? All right, two questions for you. First question, was there um, information that you need that you weren't able to find? Yeah, I feel like um, for my, I thought about looking for evidence about how it, how sports gambling affects your work pro productivity, but I didn't really find any great evidence on that or really research for it. All right, and then um, what additional questions came up as you were researching? Yeah, there was, I found a lot extra uh, questions that came up about um, its anxiety, and I, I couldn't really, I didn't really 